Your Lord is speaking to you today. I tell you whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it and it will be yours now. Faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance about what we do not see. Amen. Love, prayer, hey God, please don't allow me for love to make me confuse. Attention, lust, and chemistry with true love heal my heart, because I can't walk in love with a broken heart. Please teach me how to love and how to receive love. Show me how to build a gate around my heart and not a wall. I don't want to arrive in relationships heartless, but I want to love people to the point that they know. I learned how to love from you for someone. Your breakthrough is right around the corner. Angels have been dispatched and the word has been spoken. The pain and discomfort you are feeling is transition. The sign is clear. Some kind of miracle will happen to you this week. You will manifest something you have been waiting for. God says, stay patient. My timing is perfect. I have something bigger planned for you and trust me you are going to love it Lord hear my prayer. Listen to my cry for mercy in your faithfulness and righteousness. Come to my relief. Amen. It isn't comfortable, but just wait until you see what's beyond it. Your season is shifting. You are a magnet to incredible opportunities. Life is about to get very good for you. Life gets a whole lot better when you realize that you are not the main character. Jesus is a prayer to not go back to what you prayed. Your way out of God. Do whatever you need to do so that I don't go back to the things people and places you delivered me from. It's a lot going on right now in my life, but we have come too far to go back to that. Dear God, I know you care my prayers. I know, you hear the soft cries in my heart and I know that, no matter the circumstances that I go through, you will always be there with me. May the God of endurance and encouragement grant you to live in such harmony with one another in accord with Christ Jesus, dear God. Thank you for your everlasting love for me. Thank you for letting me be healthy and not sick in Jesus' name. I pray amen for where two or three gather in my name. There am I with them. Amen and walk in love as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us a fragrant offering in sacrifice to God. Please remind me that, no matter how hard today is, you are with me, dear God. Thank you for today. Thank you for keeping me and my family safe. I pray that, you continue to keep my loved ones safe. There is nothing back there but regret-filled lessons. I want what you have for me and not what I am familiar with and I don't want to settle for something that was meant to be a lesson and not a way of life. Please keep your hand on my life and continue to walk with me to the places that we talk about. God is saying to you, please expose the manipulators come clean about the facts and put an end to injustice. We place our suffering, heartbreak, and frustration in your hands, trusting that you will use it all for our benefit affirm. No one can use me to manipulate or at what God's intentions since has chosen one.